Hi guys and welcome to Provision Wrestling YouTube channel. Today I'm going to play in the long goodbye episode with Goldberg against Shinsuke Nakamura. Monday's Legends Night edition of WWE Raw may not have been much to write home about to kick off the new year, but the shocking ending left fans buzzing. In the episode's final few minutes, Goldberg returned to challenge Drew McIntyre for the WWE Championship at the Royal Rumble. It's a match that could either further propel McIntyre to superstardom or ruin the road to WrestleMania. The conclusion to SmackDown on Friday night was equally unpredictable, when on-air WWE official Adam Pearce emerged from a gauntlet match as the new no, one contender to Roman Reigns' Universal Championship at the Rumble. Whether the bout will go on as planned remains to be seen, but if it has changed, it raises the question of why the company bothered to put Pierce in such a prominent position in the first place. You delivered a few surprises of its own on night one of New Year's Smash on Wednesday night, most notably the debuts of Carl Anderson and Doc Gallows, their immediate alliance with Pierce. This installment of Quick Takes will explore these various topics, attempt to analyze what's next in more.we's decision to give Goldberg a WWE Championship match at the Royal Rumble was polarizing, to say the least. If the reaction it received on social media from fans wasn't enough, look no further than the dislikes the YouTube video of his raw return has at the time of publishing. After not appearing for the promotion since WrestleMania 36, the former WCW World Heavyweight Champion was always expected to be back for Mania's season this year. However, it made the most sense for him to rekindle his rivalry with Roman Reigns over the Universal Championship, not set his sights on the WWE title. From an entering standpoint, there can be zero doubt that Goldberg vs. McIntyre is a vast improvement over Goldberg vs. Reigns. Although Reigns is a more compelling character than McIntyre at the moment, the Scott has a better chance of getting a great match out of the WWE Hall of Famer at this stage of his career. It also ensures that Reigns' run as Universal Champion won't be interrupted and that a fresh face could win the Royal Rumble, assuming Goldberg walks out with the WWE title in his position. Keith Lee would be an ideal opponent for Goldberg on the grandest stage of them all, and Bobby Lashley is a believable option as well. Despite all that, the negatives outweigh the positives, and the bottom line is that Goldberg should not be wearing world title gold anymore. Putting him in marquee matches on pay-per-view is perfectly acceptable, but McIntyre vs. Sheamus is a significantly stronger WWE Championship clash at WrestleMania than anything involving Goldberg. Hope you enjoy this match guys and thank you for your attention.